Hey everybody, we're playing some more Pokemon very, very quickly. Last episode we left off on Route 12, and the only Pokemon that we had to catch was just this Marie. So, um, I went ahead, I found the Horde, I defeated all four of the Marie, just so you guys don't have to sit through it, and we're gonna catch it. Once we go catch it, we can go ahead and surf across and go get the good rod and start finally looking for that star you that I've been wanting so bad. But... First, I have to catch this Marie, and actually, now that we're... Well, the Greninja's paralyzed, so I should probably... Actually, I just use a paralyzed antidote, or whatever the thing is called. Its fluffy coat swells to double what static electricity... To double what static electricity builds up, touching it can be shocking. How are you supposed to shear the thing? I feel like that's, like, poor design. How are you gonna shear it? Okay, but... Um, paralyzed heal. An unparalyzed Greninja. And that is it for Route 12. As far as we're concerned, um, we have caught all of the Pokemon here. Um, let's fight this dude. Summon alone, summon alone. Oh, yeah. I don't know if. Uh, challenged by Alessandro? Summer Alessandro. Quillfish. Okay. Fighting in the dark in the ocean. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, do a little smackdown. I don't know, I don't think that's effective actually. It might have been a mistake. Yeah, that's alright though. Stockpile. Cool, stockpile the one, but I'm gonna go ahead and uh, pound it. No, not pound it, round it. I'm gonna round it by singing at it. Alright, level 46. Almost halfway. And then, of course, we have our uh, Pokemon we're trying to evolve behind us here. And Binacle. We got one of those, too. Um, let's go ahead and just round it right off the bat here. I don't want to use Surf on it, but I don't want to use the Rock Smash either. Ooh, okay, we might have to use Surf, because I feel like it's not going to be effective, but it's probably going to end up killing it. A little easier to do here. What kind of trainers we got? Trainers. Ooh, we got, actually got a couple trainers here. And we even get to fight the classic guy with like the five Magikarps. Alright, real quick, let me make sure. Okay, I didn't miss anything there. Let me make sure I don't miss anything over here. Anything. Okay, maybe we'll get another Lapras, maybe we won't, nah, because maybe we get that 1%, maybe, but nope, that's alright, not a very big problem here, okay, cool, there is, like, nothing over here, so we can just kind of go, first we got, I grew tired of the city life and decided to wander the world, I'm not aiming for anywhere in particular, alright, uh, backpacker Jorin, you got their bottle Leno. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, I'm gonna surf upon you with my ninja frog. Alright. Level 26. Leo level 22. Splink level 29. <clears throat> Everyone's getting a little little some some. Okay, I don't need rest. Nope, I don't need snore either. Why why would I need my psychic pig to know snore? I suppose I won't find victory in battle either unless I aim for it. Well, what are you aiming for then, bud? Ooh, okay. Ooh. Wait, I don't need a rock smasher. There's nothing in there that I need. Where are we? We're still on Route 12, right? Oh, these are the yellow flowers that I was talking about earlier. I think... Do I? Oh, I think I put the Pokemon away that had cut. Do I have a cut? Nobody's able to learn it. Um, hold on. What is what does this do? Oh no. Okay, I'll I'll come back. 
Um, remind me to come back and get that though. I, th I think I, I think I do want that item. You're about to find out just how strong my family is. You're challenged by Pokemon breeder Amala. How strong is your family, Amala? You got a spooky snake. All right, I will surf upon your spooky snake. Whew. Alrighty, what do we got here? Good rod. Okay. Yeah, I actually can't wait for that good rod. And I can't wait for the super rod. Oh, that's gonna be very, very epic. But first things first. And again, honestly, the good rod is really what I need to get that star you. That's the important part, at least for me. Lit Leo to 23. Fire Fang. Yeah, I want Fire Fang. You're at a workup. You don't need no workup. There we go. Home beat to 20. Wow, we lost. It looks like your family was even stronger. You know it. You know who I is. Question. I'm gonna make sure I didn't skip anything over here first. Because I think I can do something with that ranch. Alright, slow poke. It's not the time. I'm busy. I'm busy doing stuff. Okay, also, can you guys hear my fan? Ooh, okay, wait. Hello? You can't pick up items from the ground while on the back of a Skiddo. Okay. I love Skiddo so much. Take this TM. Alright, TM attract. Okay. Very cool. Um. The sleeping skiddo. Is there anything I can like grab over here? Ooh, I need to grab whatever that is. But how? Do I need to grab the alive skiddo? Okay. Um. Oh. Okay, I'm just going fast. Okay, I want that Pokeball. Oh, I can just like straight up drop it. Okay. No. There you go. I want to get this Pokeball. Whipped Dream. Okay. I know there should be a shiny stone around here somewhere. Where's that shiny stone? Maybe it's... Oh, is it over here? Pretty sure it's over here. Skiddo, I'm gonna need you to move for one hot moment. There we go. And that is what we need to get ourselves a Roserade, which we will definitely... 100% be doing. Okay. Well, that's what I needed as far as the Skiddo is concerned. So, thank you, Skiddo. I appreciate everything you have done for me. Um, I don't appreciate this encounter, but it's alright. He'll take it out of here, dude. Dude, I got... I got heated last episode of this Miltank. Well, actually... I would say Miltake was more of the annoying ones, but I think Mantike definitely took the cake on, like, as far as how annoying it was. But I do have all of the Pokemon on Route 12, so I don't really need any of them. Okay, he is a little bug boy. Alright, Aiden, what you got? What do you got there, bud? Um, Yanma. Go and smack down the Yanma. That'll work. Okay. All right, Whirlipede. Well, we're gonna go ahead and probably surf on the Whirlipede. We already got. Oh, did not mean to do that. Oh, he protected. That's perfect. Well, um, I misclicked on that. So, actually, um, I would have wasted a PP on surf, which actually helps. So, thank you for, uh, 
messing up me. Thank, thanks, past David. All right, Motham. Now we can go ahead and uh, throw a rock. We can throw a rock at the butterfly here. Isn't that just like a clone of Butterfree? I feel like it is. All right. Ducklet to 27. Air slash. Sure. Why don't we forget? Um. Why don't we get rid of water sport? No reason to have water sport. That's not gonna help. Cool. Psyduck 21. Splink to 30. All right, youngster Aiden. Now you really gonna start up the hive? Man, this kid's got thousand two hundred dollars just lying around. I like to bury my face in the fur around Toro's neck and take a big whiff of its scent. It's a jinx for- oh. Bro, those things probably smell, bro. Alright, Zangoose. It's a pretty cool one. I think we got our own Zangoose. I'm gonna go ahead and surf you up. I'm gonna surf all these people up. Oh yeah! Level 47. Glitleo to 24. I want to send out Tauros. Okay. And do another surf. Let's go. Bonk. Side of crew to 22. Fury swipes? No. Alright. Oh, that's right. A jinx is something that brings you bad luck. Oops. Maybe you shouldn't be sniffing on your Tauros, but it's a little weird. Not gonna lie. Fishing is all about catching and releasing. Ah, yes. He's Fisherman Murray. His five. Wait, no, six magic card. Bro, why do you have so many magic card? That's weird. Alright, well, we're gonna round every single one of them, I guess, with the terrible, terrible noise that this move makes. And we gotta do it six times. Oh, no, okay, sorry, I'm like looking down at my phone. Just keep attacking. Yep, I'm gonna keep rounding him up. Wonder what Pokemon is gonna have next. Round him up. This is gonna be voice getting tired. Honestly, man, <clears throat> I need to get to that good rod. And then once I get that good rod, dude. Back to Route 8, we go. Although, yeah, it's gonna take a little while to get back to Route 8, probably. It's gonna be a little bit of a trip, but I think we'll be fine. Alright, how many more you got there, bud? Um, was it two more? Two. Okay. We're almost there, guys. We're almost there. Alright. One more. One more roundhouse kick to the face. Alright. Oh, dang. You defeated Murray. I wouldn't have lost so badly if I just released sooner. I don't know about that one, bud. Can I have a good rod? Okay, apparently I don't get it from you. That's fine. What? What's... Oh, okay, this is the city that we need to be in. So I should probably... Hey, I challenge you to a battle in front of the gym. Prepare yourself. Okay, so we got... We have to battle her. 
Fair enough. Well, let me go back and let me... Yeah, let's go to the town. I think I want to go here first. I was a child that saw Pokemon trainer, the Great Ampharos in Azure Bay. Okay. Well, if it wasn't blah, 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 I don't care. Um, your youth is simply too much for an older... Okay, got a silk scarf. I used to buy silk scarves all the time for my wife, but I think they would do more good for... Dude, that doesn't sound like a happy marriage. I'm just going to put that out there. Can I buy some for me? Like collecting many different types of incense. Buy. Hmm. Okay. Mm, don't need any of that. Yeah. I'll take a chest, though, Barry. Thanks, bud. Yeah, let's... Um, 100. Okay. I'm, wa I'm a, a wandering young trainer, are you? Let me guess, you wish to fish for Pokemon in the water, right? Here, shall I lend you a rod? Oh, yes. That's what I need. Yeah. Good rod, that's what I'm talking about. Now we can go back to Route 8. What's going on in the Cowers I heard the electricity for Living Movie City is getting lower than usual. Hmm. Okay, where does... No, we don't need another repel now. Okay, so we gotta take the monorail over to the gym. My Magikarp is so cute watching it. I need to go on my diet again. Alright, what is all of this? Totally random TM quiz. If you give me the right answer, I'll give you a TM. Do you want to try? Sure. Here's what, what's the move that I'm describing? Prevents the target from using its held item. Oh, that's embargo. Correct. I'll give you the TM. Oh. Oh, I get embargo. Okay. Yeah, I was like, if you, if you know simple English, you probably can get that. Okay, so she gives me one TM every day. Okay. Yeah, if you took, like, Economics 101, you'd probably be able to get that. Okay, another hotel. Can I get any? I'll probably go get an old power really quick. Can I get anything from you? <gasps> Lucky egg. What does that do? What does the... Lucky egg Pokemon... What does that do again? Oh, it's just extra happiness. Okay. Oh. Well, I will definitely need to use that lucky egg on Starmie when I get it, for sure. Okay, he's got an old rod. I just got a good rod. Um, okay, there's another ribbon. Thank you. Hello, I'm the game director. If you're, uh, you're working on your Pokedex, come show me when you fill it up. Okay, so when we finish the Pokedex, that's who we come to. I don't particularly know what the prize is, but I'll try my best, I guess. Okay, so here's the thing now. We could go over to the gym, or we could go get it. Maybe we'll actually go take on this gym first, because I kind of want to end off the episode, and I want to do it in between episodes. Why, hello, David. Oh, okay, Sycamore. Congratulations, I see you finally obtained everything you need for Mega Evolution. A Mega Stone for the Pokemon, a Mega Ring for the Trainer. And a strong bond with your Pokemon. A strong bond? It's only a hypothesis, but I think the bond between Pokemon and Trainer is the key to this new evolution. But what is this bond exactly, and why are there examples of Mega Evolution only in the Kalos? There's still so much we don't know. Does this mean you think of something like Kalos's legendary Pokemon? Found only here in the Kalos region, right? Nowhere else? Maybe that's not a coincidence. Ah, what an excellent point indeed. The more you know, the more there is to research. Excitement never ends, does it? Oh, that's right, I came here to give you this. Hey, that is actually very useful. Use the TM Fly to pop right over the Pokemon Center as the place you've already visited. Well then, David. Diantha, I hope to see you again soon. I don't think I can use fly though yet. I don't think I have like the permission. Bonds, they really are important to us all, aren't they? What, but 
when I'm acting. I think I'm trying to forge a bond between myself and the character that I'm playing. If all I think about is how I'm nothing like a character, then I just hate playing it. But I, if I focus on what it, what I have in common with the character and put myself in her shoes, I might be able to understand her. It's the same for people or Pokemon. Oh, never mind. I'm just bad. You, you sure are. That was very boring. Let's have a battle next time we meet, shall we? I'm still looking forward to it. Okay. Teehee, even the movie Sardantha rides the monorail, visitors always have a one-track mind about it. How's that for- hey, these dialogues are terrible. Alright, um... Okay, fly. Ooh, ducklet's able. Ducklet can fly me? Okay, let's see. I don't think we're able to use it until we beat the gym. But we're gonna go ahead and give it a try. Let's get rid of wing attack here. Okay. Now, can we? Oh, well, I first, probably need to get out of the building, right? Can we use it? Yeah. So we need we need the next one to do it. Now, honestly, then we might as well go and beat the gym, and then we can fly over there. Yes. Sure. I will be riding that monorail. Cool. Ooh, okay, we got metronome. Pokemon or monorails? Uh, probably Pokemon. Okay, well, looks like they're both doing their own little thing there. Where am I? Okay, so there's the Pokemon Center. I met my Helioceptile close to the power plant around 13. If it bays in the sun, it gets full of energy. Do you know the do you know Dr. Fennell from Unova? Okay. Okay. Hey little kid, you wanna give me something? Okay. That's fine. Um no, I don't wanna do a winter trade. We should probably heal our Pokemon very, very quickly. We'll go ahead and do this. Just while we're I think. I don't think Greninja is hurt, I, but I do need probably some more Surf PP, so I'm going to go ahead and get that back here. Okay, let's keep exploring the town here. Mm, up or down do we go? Is house by house? I'm having fights, okay. Something about leftovers. Well, that's an item we can use, but... Okay, triple battles. Sure. Um, yeah, sure, we'll give him a tip. 100? Okay. Please listen, okay. <laughs> Wait, oh, I didn't know I could scroll further down. Okay, well, let's try it one more time. Oh, that one's a little harder. Probably Combi. What? Okay. Okay, that's gotta be Psyduck. Yeah. Coke toy. Okay, I don't... I don't have to do with that, but sure, I'll take the polka toy. All right, where else we got? What do, what's down here? Uh. So can I not get through over here? I'm guessing. Um. Uh, well, this is Route 13. Okay. Well, I don't want to come here just yet. Too fast. Black sludge. Okay. Everyone's giving me items. Um. Okay. Dude. No, I want to talk to the guy sitting. Can I talk to you, bud? Yeah. 
nothing important here. And I don't want to go down Route 13 just yet. I also need to talk to this man. Hmm. Where, is a Pokemon daycare up here? Um, okay. Oh, that I can like see. Oh, that's the city that we were just at. We took the monorail up here. That's actually pretty cool. Sorry, I'm late. So could you show me Mega Evolution? Of course. Whether you use Mega Evolution Battle or entirely, it's up to you. But I'd like to know what the potential of Pokemon really is. Okay, well, I don't have any Pokemon that I can Mega Evolve with me. So I don't think I'm going to get to do that. Um, sadly. But... Um, let's go and surf it up here. Okay. Ducklet to 28. Litleo to 25. Boink to 31. Combi to 23. Anyone else? Last call for level ups. Alright, um, I know it's not going to be effective, let's just use that. Okay. Didn't die, but that's okay. We'll just use another surf and call it. Call it a day here, not a big problem. Alright, what's your last Pokemon? Psyduck? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I think it's the same Pokemon still. I don't know what I keep forgetting. Long day. Alright, let's surf up one more time. And again, man, once... I just, need to, I just need to beat this gym so I can have Fly. And once I have Fly, a lot of things get much easier very, very quickly here. So, I won't have to run all the way back to Route 8. I'll just kind of be able to Fly there. As a Pokemon trainer, I find you really interesting. Thanks. Even though we set off from Bentonyville at the same time, you somehow became stronger than I am. What could be so different about us? Well, good luck with your gym battle. Do your best, okay? Oh, uh, yeah, I will. I just need to kind of get it done because I want to fly up in here. Okay, so this is another gym that is not really my typing. Bought a little sprout. Um, simply right. You see a vine hanging? Grab it. Okay. So what? What is? What? Is, okay, those are just decorations. I'm like, do I have to? Okay. Um. Sorry. Okay. Well, I do. I should probably be fighting everyone in here. Okay. By Pokemon Ranger Chase. Take a look. Here's some good stuff. Alright, Simi Sage. Again, it's gonna be really I'm probably gonna run out of surf PP here. Um, but it's not that big of a problem. Lick. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So uh, there's ten more Pokemon I have to beat, so as long as I kinda just um ration off my surfs for a little while. I'll be fine. Okay. Wonder if I can get Greninja to level 50 by the time um, we get the Starmie. Alright, Chase. From where'd you get your power? These guys are gonna give me a, a, a lot of shmoney, so this is, this is real good. Okay, let's jump over here. Did I miss a battler down there? Hopefully I didn't miss a trainer down there. Um, doesn't actually look like I missed a trainer, so I think we're gonna keep going here. I'll make sure I don't miss anyone, because they give a good amount of money here. Okay, let's go to this guy. Here's to, here's to challenge the gym, are you? Let's see your Pokemon, then. 
Team Maurice. It's got a Ferroseed, Lombre, and Carnivine. That's pretty cool. I like it. Well, let's go ahead and... I think Surf would actually be pretty good on Ferroseed, because I think it's Steel, right? Wow, okay. Uh, no, opposite. I, it's not effective at all. Alright, well, that's noted. I'm gonna use a round. I know its defense is high, but if I don't kill... If I can't kill it with this, then I'd be very surprised. Okay. Side up 24. He's about to send us Carnivine. So he's saving his Lone Brave for last. It's Water Gas Pokemon. Let's go hit Carnivine with a round. If, let me see if I can do more than half. If I can... Okay, then I'll probably end up just, um... Ooh, don't do that. That's gross. Wait, was that my attack or defense? Because if it was my attack, it's going to be a mistake here. Okay, it wasn't. I totally like, just didn't read that. I just skipped over it. Alright, Spoink to level 32. Okay. Uh, let's do the same thing. Let's go ahead and hit it with a round. Ah! Don't do that. Bonk. Okay. Let's go ahead and hit it with another one of these. And move on here. Ducklet grew to level 29. What, ex what excellent Pokemon you have. Okay, yo, we're getting Spoink to evolve. Don't bump, 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 bump. Okay. Very nice. We got ourselves a Grumpig. Actually, I'm actually a pretty big fan of Grumpig. He was one of my favorites back in the day. Um, yeah, I like Grumpig. Let me make sure I don't miss any trainers here. Okay, I think we're good to keep moving on this way. Oh, did I get bamboozled? I think I've been bamboozled. I, I don't actually. I don't think that's the correct way to go. I think what I have to do is actually go. Oop, I didn't mean to click that. We actually have to go down here and then go over here. Yep, there we go. Also, I gotta sneeze. My Pokemon and I will share the joy of defeating you. All right. Uh. All right, Brooke. Got for me, bud. Oh, Zelia. Hey, I like one of those. Go to Roundhouse keep in my face, and by that I mean Saint. I, dude, I don't understand this the move. Why would you name it Round? Oh, those are poison spikes. Yeah, I don't understand why it's called Round. Now, why you? Why my frog is singing. Um, but who, who, who am I to question anything? Or my damn. Okay. And let's we'll keep throwing a couple of rounds at it. Throw throw some bad notes. Hit a power. Oh boy. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, only a little bit though. Let's go ahead up a surf on this. Once again, not gonna be very effective, but it should hurt a little more than the round to go ahead and just slice off a little bit of that um, HP. Right, Psyduck to 25. Nope, you don't. You do not need Screech. That is not a very good move. Ah, uh, now comes the flood of tears of regret. Up we go. Zoinks. Zoink. 
It's actually a pretty cool gym. I like this gym. A little, little annoying having to climb these things, but I like the gym. I guess let's check over here first. Okay, dead end. Very cool. This way. I think we have one more trainer to beat before we get to the gym leader. To realize your true potential, my Pokemon I have become connected on an emotional level. Alright, Twiggy. What you got for me, Twiggy? Let's go ahead and do a round here. Got my work schedule. Let me just take a look here. Hit him with another round. Oh, I'm poisoned. Is that what I just missed? Oh, what are you doing? Don't do that. Whatever you just did, don't don't do that. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Okay, what else you got, Quiggy? Executor. Let's hit it with a round, why not? Ouch. That was not very nice. Let me hit you with a surf then. Is he gonna actually like maybe kill the Greninja? No. Okay, well at least Greninja got the surf off. Now the problem is I'm gonna need to get a second one off. Because that wasn't super effective. Don't flinch me. Dude, why do you always flinch? That's not gonna kill me, that's fine. Bro, seriously, dude? Alright, that's fine. I'm gonna use a hyper potion. Greninja just couldn't stop getting flinched and paralyzed and come on man. Stomp. Let me guess, he's gonna make me punch again. Although, I guess it didn't matter that time, because I used a different move. Dude, if you punch again... Bro, how am I supposed to win if he keeps... If he paralyzes me and then keeps stomping on me? And I literally can't do anything about it. Dude, use a different move! Of course, I didn't get par I didn't get uh, flinched, but then I was paralyzed instead. Wonderful, thank you, game. Holy, all right, here we go. Only um, the hundredth time we've tried it. I need to get myself on paralyzed like stat. Right, Combi to 26. Thanks, Twiggy. It looks like you and your Pokemon are even more in tune with one another than I am. Well, oh, don't don't take it that far. Alright, let's go ahead and grab ourselves a little, um, oh, I'm like totally in the wrong, I only got one paralyzed heal, so actually I should probably grab another one. We can go ahead and use, I think we can just go ahead and use two super potions, just because it, it is a grass type gym leader, it's probably better we don't screw around with this right now. <laughs> Skirt. Alright, one more skirt. Here we go, gym leader time. So yeah, you made it up here. I'm the gym leader, Ramos is the name. So what'd you think, Whip Whipper Snapper? Do you enjoy the garden playground I made with all these sturdy plants of mine? Their strength is a sign of my strength as a gardener and a gym leader. You sure up for facing all that? Why not? Alright, Ramos. What you got there, bud? Jump bluff? Alright, not not too, not too hard of a start. You know, there's a lot of cool grass Pokemon out there and you're throwing out a jump bluff. The only thing that is jump bluff is pretty annoying is a lot of status moves. Okay. Honestly, as long as you don't poison or paralyze me or put me to sleep. You can do all the acrobatics you want, jump on. I just don't want to be put to sleep, basically. Alright. Greninja, 49. Wait, um, extra sensory? What the heck does that do? 
80? Hmm. Let's go ahead and get rid of round. I think the psychic would actually be better than... And if I need to attack normal, I'll just do a quick attack. Like, it honestly doesn't really matter. Alright. Duck like the 30. Nah, we don't need roost. Let Leo to 28. Nope, don't need Endeavor here. Grumpig to 33. Weeping Bell. Um, let's use our let's use the new psychic move. Might as well. Oh, it's a poison type though, so it's not gonna be effective. It is super effective. Why is it super effective? I don't know actually why that's super effective. I mean, I'll take it. Sure, man. I didn't realize Psychic was good against Poison, or was it the Grass part? Alright, we got Go Go here. Okay. I think it was effective against the Poison. I don't. I really thought Poison was effective against Psychic for some reason, though. Also, I probably should just use Surf there in the first place. But maybe not. Maybe that's not effective either. Okay, well, this Go Go is actually fairly strong. Um, but we got it. Ooh, okay. Bringing out the potion. Uh, that's not gonna help for too long here, but... Just a couple more extra cents. And it's really nice, because this extra sensory has 20 PP on it. There's quite a bit. Which is pretty nice. Bulldoze, alright. A little bit more damage on me, but that's alright. My speed's falling pretty quickly. Oh, another one. Why? Don't, don't do that. Why do you do that? Okay, here we go. Another one. Another one. Another one. Alright, well it got me all the way down to 53, but now what I'm scared of, is it faster than me? Yeah, it's faster than me now. Alright, but we're fine. Yeah, we won. A little close, a little close. This Go Goat was actually like a pretty decent challenge with its um, the lowering speed and stuff like that. Pretty decent challenge, but we got it. You can't take things too quickly when it comes to forming a friendship with your Pokemon. You believe in your Pokemon and they believe in you too. Mighty Oaks from the Acorns grow. Go on then, you've earned it. Here's your uh, Sprout Badge. Cool. I can go fly now. Alright, you got yourself a plant badge. You can use fly and level 60. Very cool. Grass knot. Okay. That TM there is for grass knot. You can use it to trip your opponent up in the grass. The heavier the opponent, the harder they'll fall. Alright. Cool. Well, I really just did all that because I really wanted that fly. Um, the fly makes it so much easier to go back to Route 8. Um, so now, I think we can head back. We can go to Route 13, or we can go to Azure Bay. I don't know which one we go to first. Um, but we're going to go ahead and save, and guys... Um, yeah, I'm gonna end the episode off here. We did actually, I let it run a little over time just because I wanted to start off the next episode with getting started. So I'll see you guys next episode.